Now to the latest in the molestation case, uh, Preeti Zinta filed against uh, Ness Vadia. The Mumbai police will be sending an email to her first, asking her to record her statement in the case because she is currently out of the country. CNN and IBN's Shavan Sen with the very latest. Once in a picture-perfect relationship, now in a legal battle following the June 12th molestation case. The story of Preeti Zinta and Ness Vadia clearly goes beyond what transpired at the May 30th IPL match. As the Mumbai police probes this star-studded case, more details have emerged. The Mumbai police will send an email to Preeti Zinta urging her to record her statement as soon as possible. Email exchanges between her and Ness Vadia will be examined. The statements of IPL members will also be recorded. IPL COO Sundar Raman has told CNN-IBN that the Mumbai police hasn't gotten in touch with him. He has started recording the statements of eyewitnesses. At the same time, he has started collecting corroborative evidence. But in what could be a roadblock in the probe, CCTV footage of the alleged altercation, the tapes on which police was relying upon, is absent. As far as action against Preeti Zinta's ex-boyfriend and team co-owner is concerned, Mumbai police is treading a cautious path closely examining and gathering all possible evidence. Last year's spot fixing scandal and now a molestation charge by a team co-owner. IPL is posing a challenge every year for Mumbai police. In Mumbai, this is Shavan Sen.